So this video was about the federal eviction moratorium. As you can see, it's clearly over. The Supreme Court ruled against it. And you know, it's funny because I took the time to read it. And by me doing all this research, it's able to help me understand what's going on when I read an article like that and see that the CDC relied on a statute to do something. And the whole point of that is that if you are a U.S. citizen, you're under federal and state law. It says it right there in the 14th Amendment. So, as you can see, that federal eviction had absolutely nothing to do with what I'm doing. That moratorium, first off, in Maryland, the moratorium ended August the 15th. And now the federal moratorium is over. But guess who will still be running out their spot after the next 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80 years. I believe this by that time, I had to own the whole place. If I wanted to own the whole place now, I could. I just did the one apartment because that's what I have access to right now. But if I really wanted to own the whole apartment complex, I could use the same process that I used to stop the rent. So as much as y'all keep talking about, oh, eviction moratorium this, eviction moratorium that, Y'all see that that moratorium had nothing to do with the eviction. It was not going to stop my eviction. Like I said, I stopped my eviction. I stopped it with the defense I put up. I showed y'all the defense, which y'all never respond to. Now, like I said, y'all, I'm going case search. Look up the case number. Just look it up. It says hold until September 8th. I guarantee you that a lot of people would have been evicted by then. I'm not going to be one of those people. I feel, I feel sorry for people that get evicted, but I'm going to have spots soon. So if y'all need more spot, if y'all need a spot because y'all got evicted, y'all can come holler at me for real. You feel me? Like I said, I'm a real private landlord. So if y'all need some spots, I'm going to have them coming up real soon. But as y'all can see, the moratorium had nothing to do with stopping the eviction. I stopped the eviction. Like I said, I'm going to give y'all another video when I get another response from the district court saying I got another moot motion. And then after that, like I said, if y'all still want to troll me, y'all want to pay rent, that's y'all choice. I'm not trying to stop somebody from paying rent. I'm telling you that you don't have to. But if you want to, be my guest. You feel me? I don't got shit to do with that. But I know for a fact that nobody could take possession back of that apartment that I rented out. And I'm about to have more spots. The IRS cannot do anything about it. The rent that I get is not considered income connected to a trade of business within the United States. And the money that I make and all my property is called a foreign estate. So as long as I got a foreign estate, which I do. Now my name doesn't have a foreign estate. My name is under the Eternal Revenue Code, but I'm not. So I have a foreign estate. So all that money's tax free. And I'm actually supposed to be picking the rent up later. So. I say I need more spots. Because I need to be picking up more rent that the IRS can't take money from. Like I said. Nobody can prove me wrong. Y'all just want to troll because y'all miserable. Like I said, y'all always get mad at the people that try to help you for real. Like I said, I ain't even come on here to try to, like, make fun of nobody, for real. That was never my intention. Even from the video that got, like, about 3,000 views, or y'all talk with the most stuff in the world that y'all have no clue about what y'all talking about. I just came to show y'all that we have no rights because y'all keep thinking that y'all U.S. citizens. If you don't even know what a right is, you have never seen freedom a day in your life. Ever. If you can't stop from dying, you've never seen freedom. 
So, like I said, don't want to get too much, too much off topic. But I said it once, I'll say it again. Maryland moratorium is over. The federal moratorium is over. And it's not going to be an eviction. I'm going to get an eviction notice every time that they do a warrant of restitution. It's not going to hold any merit because there's no subject matter jurisdiction for the warrant. And this is another thing which I don't understand too. By the time that I hopped on this lawsuit, it was already at the warrant of restitution stage. So I stopped it in its tracks at the warrant of restitution. If I would have did this before I even got to that point, it wouldn't have even been a possession judgment to begin with. And even if they got a possession judgment, who cares? The leasing office owns the apartment. They just can't take back possession. And unless I want to give them back possession, they can't take back possession. So, I got to get free rent and rent it out. Make free money. Every week, I could do self-help evictions. Can't none of y'all do self-help evictions at all. Y'all putting them people out. I mean, hey, y'all lost billions. You're not really a private landlord. You're a public landlord. So unless you can prove me wrong, which nobody can, keep checking case search. And for somebody keep talking about put up a video of my cash at for real, like y'all gotta understand, like whatever video I put up, I do that for free. You feel me? Like I said, the, like the videos that y'all request, like like all this ca oh walk in the apartment, show your cash at. Like what are you talking about? Like if I rented it out, I'm not ready to walk in there. Unless I have to walk in there, I'm not ready to do that for y'all. Y'all want to pay? Like this is not free. A mom so broke. Why y'all can't kick out no bread? Y'all must be the broke ones. Cash at me. I walk in the apartment. You cash at me, I'll show you the cash at. But till then, if you ain't got no bread to pay me for the cash at, go on Maryland Case Search and wait for September the 8th. Because when I put in the motion to vacate judgment, it says hold until September the 8th. On September the 8th, it's going to say warrant for restitution. Request for service was canceled. The first one already says that. The second one is one to say that. The third, fourth, fifth one is one to say that. I got reasonable rates. I got reasonable rates, but y'all ain't coming at me with the broke stuff at all. So get your money right and holler at me. Because as much as y'all trolling, y'all don't own nothing. Even with the leasing office owning that apartment, I own that apartment. The leasing office can't do nothing about it. So like I said, you, you trying to spend some money to get your life right? I definitely got you. And you can tell the government, I'm charging for this. I'm charging for this. Tell the government everything. Tell them everything. They cannot do nothing to me. I keep telling y'all that the government cannot do anything to me. I am the representative of my name. They've already been served notice. Y'all can take it up to the government as much as y'all want. They will not do anything. We're part of that, don't y'all understand? They will not respond because I am right. They're not willing to send an affidavit saying I'm wrong. Law talk with Mike admitted that you could live rent free for the rest of your life. And it really wasn't nothing to admit. He can't prove me wrong. I was already saying you could live rent free for the rest of your life. Law talk with Mike agreed with me. He can make troll videos about cyber citizens all he wants. But I ain't a cyber citizen. He agreed with me. Everybody else, they don't want to agree with me. That's cool. But like I said, you can't prove me wrong and everything I'm saying is right. So... You either want to pay me rent, pay me to help you, you want to pay me. And I need that. I'm a businessman. And I don't play about my business. I never did. Never played about my business. So, y'all get your money right and holler at me, man. Because on 9 to 8, when it says request for service to cancel, 
ticket is going up flat. The ticket is definitely going up. Like, I got crazy fees now. Like, think about how much the lawyers is charging an hour. How much y'all think I need an hour? Like, how much y'all think I need a couple for a minute, for a second? Like, y'all can't afford that way. Y'all say, oh, I got this, I got that. I don't pay rent. Ever. And we'll never pay rent. And I'm going to keep renting them out. So, get your money up and holler at me. Because till then, I have yet for anybody to prove me wrong yet. So, you either going to get with the light. Or, it's your life. Choose whatever you want to do for real. But like I said, y'all trolling. And for what? For absolutely nothing. So, like I said, if y'all don't want to believe... You gotta take everything that come along with that. I ain't got nothing to do with that. I've already won. You ever wanna win, you gonna stay a loser. And see a lot of y'all cool with being losers. Sad though. But yeah, get your money right and holler at me.